Welcome to another edition of IMO Sports with Pedro Justice. Dominic Brazil versus Dillian White for the interim heavyweight title. In the meantime, Deontay Wilder and Tyson Fury are finalizing their rematch for May. And Big Baby Miller and Anthony Joshua will fight in June in Madison Square Garden. The heavyweight division is shaping up. And the WBC did not want the division to get stagnant. So they put White, who is the WBC silver heavyweight titleist, versus Dominic Brazil, who is the mandatory challenger to Deontay Wilder. And it's like, hey, basically, you guys got to fight each other right now. And the winner of that more than likely will get the next shot at being the mandatory for Deontay Wilder. But if things play out like fans want, Deontay Wilder or Tyson Fury, the winner of that will face Anthony Joshua, and then the winner of that will then face the winner of Dominic Brazil and Dillian White. And so I'm excited. 2019 is picking up from where 2018 left off and where 2017 started things. Boxing is definitely on its way up. I'm excited about this fight. I think that Dillian White had the better last year because his fights were more exciting no matter what you think about the opponents when the end conclusion was more dominating. Dominic Brazil, what did he do last year? The fight that I did see of his, it was sloppy, and he got the guy out, but it was sloppy. And so I wasn't very impressed by Dominic Brazil. It didn't seem like he was in great shape. And so I'm giving the edge to Dillian White because it seems like he's hungry. It seems like there's something between him and Eddie Hearn where he knows AJ is the apple of Eddie Hearn's eye. And Dillian White knows that. And so there's a video that I made and there's a video from IFL where you can see the two meet each other in the hallway and they're discussing why the fight didn't happen and what was going on. They're going back and forth. And it's like in his heart, Dillian White started flirting with the idea of signing with another promoter and another uh, boxing entity because he feels he's being shafted by Eddie Hearn. But he's being patient and waiting his turn. And I think that this interim title is another chance for him to put a notch in his belt and also inch closer to a heavyweight title fight. So it looks like by the summertime, we should know who will be facing who in the heavyweight division based on the outcomes in the beginning of the year. Let me know what you think. Until next time, it's Pedro Justice.